Hello and welcome to the Street Crime UK YouTube channel. Please don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Today we look at a Liverpool model who was jailed for 5 years for her part in a £627,000 cocaine plot. Kelly Askew was caught with 2 kilograms of high purity cocaine hidden in the footwell of her Mercedes. Police swooped on the 30 year old as she was behind the wheel of the vehicle on Manchester Road Bolton. Her ex-boyfriend, John Clayton, who was in the passenger seat admitting supplying coke before her trial began at Bolton Crown Court. The West Derby man received a jail sentence for 7 years and 8 months. Mother of two, Miss Askew of Green End Park, also West Derby, was jailed for 5 years by a jury, majority 10 to 2. The pair had been heading towards the M62, apparently back to Liverpool as they had briefly met a man in a remote country lane near Bradford. The well-suited man walked up to the Mercedes, had a conversation with Mr Clayton before the car drove off. Unbeknown to the couple, they were being watched by undercover police who followed them. During the trial, Miss Askew had claimed she knew nothing about the drugs and Mr Clayton backed her up by saying the cocaine belonged to him. The jury dismissed their claims, however, and just took over four and a half hours to find Miss Askew guilty. Mr Clayton, aged 34, from Weymouth Close, pleaded guilty to possession of Class A drugs with intent to supply at an earlier hearing. Handing out the sentence, Judge Timothy Clayton said, On June 11th, the two of you, acting together as a team, were involved in the transportation of just under 2 kilograms of high-purity cocaine. In the course of this, the cocaine was moved from Liverpool to Bradford. It is absolutely apparent that both of you were highly trusted by those higher up the chain. This was very important assistance you gave to a regional drug dealer or dealers and therefore it is very serious offence and you are importantly involved in the supply chain at a high level. Judge Clayton said that Mr Clayton was significantly more culpable than his former girlfriend but added, Kelly Askew, you, you have clearly demonstrated to have been knowingly and willingly involved in this. Both of you will serve half of their sentences before being released on license. Miss Askew said she had previously worked in pubs and clubs around the northwest. She has also modelled sleepwear and wedding dresses. Mr Clayton says he was forced to transport the drugs because someone he knew had disappeared, owing £30,000 to a loan shark, and left him with the debt. He said threats were made against his family, which he took seriously because his brother Richard was shot dead in 2001 as he ran from a gym in Aigberth. During the trial, Mr Clayton told the jury how he had received a death threat letter in prison, which said, we will start with your bird's car and then your house. Kelly Lynn Askew, 31, of Weymouth Close, West Derby, was jailed for five years at Bolton Crown Court after she was convicted of possession of the drug with intent to supply. But continuing to press her innocence, she launched an appeal application which was rejected by three top judges at London Crown Court. Mr Justice Owen, with Lord Justice Hooper and Mr Justice Roderick Evans, said Miss Askew's appeal had no prospect of success and threw it out of court. She was caught after police followed her and her partner as they travelled on the M62 from Bradford, having earlier been seen with a suspected drug dealer. A search of a car revealed two blocks of powder, weighing almost two kilos, but with a cocaine content of around 1.25 kilos at 100% purity. When arrested, she claimed she knew nothing of the cocaine and maintained the story at her trial, but was disbelieved by the jury and convicted. Her partner, John Clayton, also from Liverpool, admitted the same offence and was jailed for seven years and four months. Her legal team said that the prosecution failure to disclose evidence earlier during the trial prevented them from running a particular line of defence, but the judges rejected the appeal application and condemned Miss Askew to complete her punishment. So what are your thoughts about Mr Clayton and Miss Askew and how they attempted to deliver 2 kilograms of cocaine but were followed and captured by police? Please share your thoughts in the comments below. Thanks for joining us and until next time, stay safe.